It's always a beautiful day at the Dickerson Park Zoo when I get to learn about things. And Joey, you were showing me something today that I honestly have no idea what it is. If you pointed to it, I would be like, I don't know the name of that. Where, so, are, we, where are we at? Okay, so what would you guess if you take it, took a look? I would guess it was a hog. It's a hog. Mm -hmm. Well, it does have a very pig-like look, but these are yeah. actually called Chacoan peccaries. Okay. They are native to South America, and the really cool thing about their story is until the 1970s, they thought they were extinct. What? So they were rediscovered, and one of the really great success stories of zoos is accredited zoos are working to repopulate and reintroduce this endangered species into the wild. So we're pretty excited because we have a breeding pair. We oh just got a little girl in. Her name is Chiquita. And she and uh, Elmer mm -hmm. are getting along really well. Okay. So typically what happens when we introduce animals is called a howdy introduction. And it might take a few days. You know, you first let them kind of see each other, kind of smell. Very first day, he was right there. He was like, I think I like her. I like <gasps> Chiquita. And was it love at first sight? I think it was pretty much love at first sight. Mm. So they are a breeding pair. And we are very, very hopeful that we might actually have at some point some baby peccaries. OK, so then what's the next step? You know, it's all about, you know, repopulating them and exactly. taking them off the endangered species list. So let's say they do have a little baby. So this is an animal that is part of the SSP or the Species Survival Plan. So mm -hmm. as an accredited zoo, which uh, we are very proud to get our accreditation for the eighth time in a row. So that, uh, that means we don't just breed because we want to. Mm -hmm. It has to be uh, genetically diverse, and so this, these two, if they are successful and we have babies, obviously the baby will stay with mm -hmm. mom and dad yeah. for a while, but it will eventually then, because of its genetics and its DNA, will probably go on to another zoo, so you can diversify mm -hmm. uh, the genetics and, and have a really healthy population so we don't ever have to worry and think that this species has gone extinct again. I see, I, when you hear, see, hear things like that, you're like, what happened? Why did they almost go extinct? What happened? And then how do you bring them back? But it's because of zoos like the exactly. Park Zoo that you can bring them back. Yes, so we have you know the Species Survival Plan, and then we have the Saving Animals from Extinction Program, both through AZA, and they mm -hmm. work within the zoos to make sure there's a healthy population, and within the wild to make sure there's a healthy population. So we really just work hand in hand, and it's, mm -hmm. it's really incredible. But we're very excited to have Chiquita here. Mm -hmm. We're very excited that they're getting along. And I'm telling you, just Google baby peccaries and see how cute they are. Uh, they're sometimes called porcupine pigs, and you can oh. see why. Yeah, totally. Uh, yes. Do we have a timeline, hopefully, like when mating season might be? Well, this is their mating season. OK. So their keepers have been paying close attention, haven't really seen any of those behaviors yet. But, you know, they did say that they were kind of, you know, looking for some privacy. So mm -hmm. we're hoping. So Joey, I love all the work that you do. A lot, you know, every time I'm here, I'm learning something different about the conservation and just about helping animals in general. If somebody wants information, you know, on everything you offer here, including the memberships, the, the hours of operation, just everything. And if they want to see these beautiful peccaries, what's the best way to get in touch with you? Go on our website, dickersonparkzoo.org. Mm -hmm. We also have an entire section on our website about all of our conservation efforts mm -hmm. around the world. It's really fascinating. Mm -hmm. uh, we have been recognized for a zoo our size for the amount of work and what we contribute to the conservation efforts. So we're very proud of that. So dickersonparkzoo.org, get your membership and come and keep an eye on the peccaries. All right, you know, I was just thinking, Joey, I feel a little awkward now, because what if we're interrupting their yep. romantic you know, time? They're, they're, court, we, they're courting. They're courting. Yeah, we should I, probably we turn should, this way. Okay, yeah. I'm going to look this exactly. way. But okay, head to Dickinson Park Zoo. Do it. <laughs> You're too much. I was. I didn't want to intrude. You were being very respectful. Thank you. So let's do an animal animal psychic test. Now I'm getting a little choked up here. I would love here. to. It's happening. I would love it. <clears throat> I would love it to be so donuts. Psychic. I know. <clears throat> I feel like I have um, Natalie Nunn's cashews mm -hmm. stuck with it they're so good so much sugar this morning and so much food okay i am thinking of an animal that can be found in australia kangaroo no wallaby no dingo no kookaburra no shark no jeremy name them name them name them <laughs> who is it name em. what I, don't they have like the world's deadliest spiders oh that's an arachnid not an animal Come on. Why are you shaming me? You're, you're I'm not shaming. I am educating. Your knowledge, okay. your knowledge shaming me. OK. I'm thinking of an animal that loves. Wait, isn't a spider an animal, though? It's, it's an arachnid. Yes, but it's an animal. Oh, it's still. It's in the animal kingdom. Well, look who the blonde is here. Look how the, my, how the turntables turn have turned. turned. <laughs> OK. Um, I'm thinking of an animal that loves the cold. 
Okay, are you ready? Mm-hmm. Polar bear. No. Um, a grizzly bear. No. Koala bear. No. A uh, penguin. Yes! Okay. There you go. You were close. I was going to say stay okay. where you were. We need to pull a sudden track. So every time we have to list them, just keep going. Name them. Name them. Name them. Name them. Name Some of y'all get that. Some of y'all don't. Name them. But I just say name them. Name them. <laughs> okay. I'm thinking of an animal that could be found right here in Missouri. I'm sending it out. I'm sending it out. I receive it and I believe it. A deer. Yes! I named him. How did you name it? How did I name it? I just knew it. How did you even name that? Okay. okay. Oh, I'm thinking of a domesticated animal. Sending it, sending it, receive it, believe it. Name him dog. Named it. Named it. <laughs> this is too easy, Charlie. I know. Okay. I'm thinking of an animal you can see at the Dickerson Park Zoo. Go. What was that thing you just were talking about that was mating? Peccary. Peccary. Name them. Uh, uh, elephant. Name them. Lions. Name them. Tigers. Name them. Bears. Name them. Oh my. <laughs> flamingos. Yes! Go! Ah! That, was, uh, that was help from producer Charlie. He goes, flamingos. How did you know that, Charlie? He, That's so strange. He is Charlie psychic. All the way from upstairs. Oh, are we have 15. Okay. Um, um, I'm thinking of a, uh, a species of bird. A dodo bird. No. A canary. Baseball. C Cardinal. Yes. Name. Boom. Okay. All right, guys, don't go anywhere. More, More fun. fun. On Ozark Fox AM. I got it. Name them. Name them. <laughs>